Hi guys, Silver here and welcome to Resident Evil Preed, a remake. This pandemic has spread faster than any disease in modern history. He was knocked out conscious a citywide emergency has been declared. The CDC has quarantined the lower Midwestern Officials region of the can't U.S. Say. Commitment, honesty, integrity, these are the core values that create the foundation for Umbrella. It's this foundation that will continue to build a brighter future for all of us. Resident Evil 3. Net umbrella. She survived. It's worse every night. Three more days, then I can kiss this town goodbye. Jill's report. September 26th, 1998. It's already been two months since that mess with Umbrella. Thanks to the suspension, investigations haven't progressed exactly as it hoped. Perhaps this written record of what I found will prove to, my, to be my final duty as STARS officer. I can only hope that it helps lead to the truth. T-Virus. Those infected by this virus seem to become literal zombies. It appears to be communicable via several different avenues outlined below bite from an infected individual allowing the mixing of bodily fluids, contact with crows which have been eaten infected carrion. Due to the strength of the virus, airborne infection cannot be discounted. 
It should be noted that those who survived the incident have not yet developed symptoms. It's unclear whatever this is because the virus has a long incubation period or because we just happen to be resistant to the infection. We have to remain vigilant even after this investigation period ends. As for me, aside from my minor difficulties sleeping, I seem to be in final, fine shape. Still, I shouldn't get too hopeful. After all, this could just be an extended incubation. Investigation notes. <coughs> Umbrella, pharmaceuticals company industry leader in market share, focuses on military weapons development while maintaining cover as pharmaceutical company, also secretly developing bioweapons. The virus outbreak at Arclay Mountains Research Facility predicated the Dimensions incident. Conspiring with Raccoon City leadership, large donations to Mayor Warren's office effectively controls the city. Okay. What do we have here? Message from colleague. To Jill Valentine. Hey, Hotshot. How are you holding up? I still can't believe Iron suspended you. It's such bullshit. He ought to pin a medal on you for making it out of that hellhole back in July. Of course you are going to poke around and ask questions about it. I hope you are not mad at me for keeping my head down. Everything's been happening so fast. Stars was the pride of the force. When the chief disbanded us out of nowhere, I thought for sure I was going to lose my job. Word has it you are planning to leave Raccoon City. I figure you wouldn't take the suspension lying down. Just promise to watch your back, Umbrella won't see it by a while. You try to dismantle their business. Be careful, Jill. Rat Wicker, Star Alpha Team, now and forever. Was scriptum had to slip this message to Pizza Guy. To avoid detection, enjoy the extra large Mega Meat Supreme. It's on me and the guys. Thanks, Brad. Looking okay. No infection. All fine. Sealed envelope. They've got me pinned down at home. Guys across the street are watching me from their window 24 7. Are they Aaron's men? Umbrellas? I don't know. And there's no real difference anyway. I know what they are trying to do. They want to wear me down, torment me into compliance, and it's working. I'm barely eating, barely sleeping. I'm going crazy. I feel like the living dead. But I won't let them win. I have to get out of the city and find a way to make them accountable. They'll send someone to silence me, of course. If you hear that I've been killed or whatever, it is they do to the people like me. You must pick up the investigation where I left off. I've enclosed my files, they'll tell you everything you need to know, as long as this package isn't intercepted. I'll be moving out at night, five days. Wish me luck. Alright, I'm coming. Okay, wait, I'm here. Who's so impatient? Hello? Hello? Jill, are, are you okay? Brad, is that you? Listen, you gotta get out of there. What are you talking about? I don't have time to explain. You gotta get out of there right now. All right, let me grab my... Ah! Damn 
He's crazy. Okay? What was that thing? Damn if I know. But right now it's got a hard on for the only two stars left in town. You and me. I'm not sticking around. Just look around you. The longer we wait, the more screwed we are. How did this all happen so fast? <clears throat> I don't know. One fucked up thing always leads to another. It's like Arclay on steroids. to get us.
parking garage isn't far. I can. The only it. safe place is in here. Sir, what's your name? I can't just leave you behind. It's Dario Rosso. And yeah, right. You just want to steal my safe house. Get your own, Missy. Okay. Brad couldn't do that. Oh well. We'll never know. doesn't care. Come on. Oh, come, come on. Start, damn it. It's my turn, bitch. You don't feel like this is a good idea, right? I got you. Who are you? What are you doing? My name's Carlos, and I'm saving you. Come on. Let's get you someplace safe. I think we're in the clear. Hope so. We've been bringing survivors here. Here where? My guys have converted some subway cars into a shelter. It's safe. I'm fine. Personal space. Okay, I get it. Let's go. Oh, come on. Who's the dipshit to close this? Sorry, we're gonna have to go around. Hey, what do you know about that monster? Nothing. I've never seen anything like it. But it's no zombie. It knows what it wants and won't stop till it gets it. Don't you like that in a man? No thanks. He's all yours. I promise you're in good hands. I'm with the Umbrella Biohazard Countermeasure Service. UBCS for short. Are you kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? You guys are the ones who caused all of this. Whoa, 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 whoa. What are you talking about? Look, you don't have to trust me, but I'm going to the shelter. You coming? Come on, it's this way. 
I can't even point a gun at him. And what if I don't trust the umbrella? Hello, guys. Hey, Captain. This fine young lady could use our help. Carlos, you didn't even think to ask fine young lady her name? She is an elite operative of RPD, Special Tactics and Rescue Service. Her name is something Valentine. It's Jill. Nice to meet you, Jill. I am UBCS, platoon leader Mikhail Viktor. My team was sent here to rescue civilians. Right. How's that going for you? The city is completely cut off, isolated. Most of the hundred thousand civilians will wind up dead. Uh, correction, undead. My platoon has suffered serious losses. Just keeping them alive is more than I can manage. Well, you can thank your corporate overlords for that. Yes. Well, we are doing all we can. If we can get this subway train moving, we can evacuate some survivors. But we need help. My men cannot do this alone. I'm in. But I am on their side, not yours. Oh, hey. It's cool. We all want the same thing. Thank you, Joe. All right, super cop. Here you go. We can use this to stay in contact. I know what a radio is. <laughs> okay, first things first. We need to get you geared up. Head up to street level. You'll find supplies there. All right. Okay, UBCS ammunition crafting guide on the battlefield. If you run out of ammo, you're gone about as useful as wet art. Want to stay alive out there? Then get this basic formula into your skull. Okay, two gunpowder. Handgun ammo. Gunpowder and high grade. Shotgun and two. Okay. Nothing new. The Cannibal Murders, a complete die guest. In the grey of the morning on September 25th, a frantic colored uh, caller telephoned uh, the RPD. To report an assault. A man described as disheveled, like a bargant, was attacking a passerby north of Lamb's Museum of Art. The responding officers discovered the mutilated corpse of a woman by some dumpsters nearby. Dozens of bite marks covered her body as she had been dismembered, suggesting she had been eaten. The third known incident of this kind to occur in Raccoon City this month. So what do you need? Who's been munching on a man stick? We had news commit have a gnawing feeling that the so-called cannibal disease patients Spencer Memorial has been providing free treatment. Who since August might not be settling for just the cafeteria food. Our reports have infiltrated Sp Spencer Memorial asked the tough questions and come back with horror stories but will make your stomach royal. Turn the page for the scope. Okay. Jill? It's me again. You topside yet? Working on it. So what's the plan? The old tanks got me clearing the tracks. You might get the subway infrastructure back online. And how do I do that? Let's start by restoring power. I'll navigate you to the substation once you hit the main road. Copy that. Let's do this fast. Can you get this map? No? No? Too bad. What do we have here? Green herb, another one. Gunpowder, another one. Mm. 
Okay, same new. moving. I've reached the main avenue. Which way do I go? See a big transmission tower? That's the substation. You'll have to circle around through an alley to your right to get there. You mean the alley that's on fire? Maybe. Surely a tall drink of water like yourself can put out a few flames. <sighs> Fuck you. This with my game part. see him. It's way too dark. Hey! 
I'm hurt. Where do you guys come from? Store owner journal. This new hair tonic from Umbrella is just flying off the shelves. The stuff they make always works wonders, so it's no surprise. I was counting on this and ordered a huge shipment. My instincts are paying off. Literally. I just know sales will continue to rise as the world gets out. That said, the string of violent incident on the news has me worried. Maybe I ought to invest in a good safe to hold. All this cash was rolling in. The new safe is just perfect. Nobody knows the code. Not even my wife. It's a secret between me and my beautiful Aqua Cure Queen. Okay, so what it is? Is it nine, three, seven? Right. too fast. Violence getting worse and worse these past few days. Got a shotgun for when it hits a breaking point. Locking it up in a gun rack that should keep it safe from many would-be looters while I go out and trying to find some more shells. If things go south, cut the chain and bust out that sucker. I pray we all make it out alive.
Nice. Wasn't worth it. Okay, you can wait. I'm gonna go cut our bolts. Still going that way. And I will get there. I definitely need that shotgun.
hear UBCS? Yeah, careful, careful. Come on, don't look at me like that, all right? I'm not an effective. Okay, no, 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 wait, please! What the fuck? He was infected. He might have been infected. All stars this soft. No wonder so many of you dead. And what are you, UBCS, killing your own people? He would have turned. There's your sense of self-preservation. Go back to the subway station. I don't need a bleeding heart like you getting in the way. Suck it, prison. The Umbrella Corporation just recruited me for the job. A job. Don't know how we're gonna wipe out a life sentence for murdering 20 gangbangers, but whatever. I'll take it. Beats shitting away the rest of my days behind bars. I gotta get back in shape. Target practice at 400 yards, 5 misses, got the chain yesterday and got moved to UBC's training camp where I fired my first bullet in 2 whole years, missed a stationary target by 5 inches at 400 yards. I never fucking do that, it's like I forgot everything, doesn't matter, I'll get sharp again, watch me. Ok, I've got my shot dropping down to 3 inches, feeling good, feeling good. After lunch they put me through my first mock battle. The cap and the other guys are good people. And goddamn beast of war at that. But what the fuck is up with that lunatic Nikolai? He used me as fucking human shield just to score some extra points. Murph is back, baby, you'll never see me miss another target. Tomorrow I gonna move on my first mission, riot control in Raccoon City. I think Jimmy would like that. My brother was always the first to reach out and help people, right up until those street punks took him away from me. Now it's my turn to do some good for, for a change, the way I know best. The Middle East, Eastern Europe, East Africa, I thought I knew what the hell was, figured I'd never crack, no matter what was thrown at me, but this job, this one was supposed to be easy, a quick wage, I'd earned it. It all happened at once, there were 30 guys in our squad, all armed with a state of art assault rifles, and yet we were wiped out in less than 48 hours. I've been through enough shit to know it only even get worse, and if that was just the beginning, maybe I'm a coward, I don't care. This is the only way I have left. I just hope my body doesn't get back up after I pull the trigger. Mm. Bad ending. Okay, already tried this. I don't get it, how do they take so many bullets? <sighs> 
to all employees. In response to the violent outbreaks across the city, we have implemented an international power outage. Once the situation has been brought under control, please activate the four breakers as soon as possible. Once that done, turn on the main power switch. Easy. Or maybe not. Oh, it smells like... Oh, I don't even want to think about it. No comment. Don't know what we were thinking. Mumbling this scene. Okay, let's see. Damn those sounds. Okay, one more left. Power switch. Well, I think this is a great place to wrap it all up. Thank you for watching and see you next time. Bye!